Welcome back. According to the American Psychological Association, there has been a 40% increase in mental health problems among our kids in the last decade. But having words of encouragement from someone who's been there can go a long way. I'm here to chat about his new books for kids that he's written from his own experiences is local author Vincent Lancey. So welcome to the show. So great to have you here. Thank you so much for having me. I'm really yeah. excited to be here. Yeah, so I can't wait to find out more about you because you have written several books here. So let's start with how you got into writing. Um, it wasn't what we would think, right? So kind of start with that story. Becoming an author was not always the plan. When yeah. I was 21, I was hit by an intoxicated driver leaving the bar while I was walking home. I had to relearn to walk and talk, and that shifted what I want out of life from a mm. corner office, my finance degree, to the high salary, to just being unfulfilled and jumping into entrepreneurship, mm. sharing my story as much as I can, writing some books, hosting mm. some podcasts to make a difference, as I know we're never alone. We all have a story to share. And now that's just extended to book coaching and podcast coaching where I get to help people find their own voice like I've been able to do. Wow. Yeah. How long was that recovery journey for you and then the time between you being fully recovered to, to writing your first book? Oh, I'm not sure it will ever be a full recovery, but yeah. from where it's at, I didn't notice a significant change in my memory for six years. Wow. I went to grad school, did all these things with as I say, a half a brain where my traumatic brain injury, my short-term memory is severely impacted. I was a student who can look over a piece of paper before a test and mm -hmm. get a B, no problem, yeah. to a student who had to read, write, type, read, write, type over and over and over again, rewire my brain to retain just a little bit of that information. In graduate school, three C's and you're dropped no matter what. So there is a whole new work ethic that had to be instilled. And from there, that just drove right into entrepreneurship. Started speaking after being chosen as the MBA speaker mm -hmm. for my graduate degree. I yeah. said, maybe I can do this right. for real. And yeah. I went out there, started sharing my story, just evolved into the books and then into the podcasts. And wow. I'm not really sure what's next, but right now I'm focused on coaching with a huge passion, as you said, for school speaking. Yeah. Getting out there, uh, Left Alive book tour is coming soon to Hillsborough County. Okay. Very exciting. Well, let's talk about your latest book. Can oh, we please. talk about that? It's a it's a children's book. Yes, Going to School, the official book for toddlers. I unintentionally created a mental health book series mm. where I started with uh, older students and adults, did an elementary school book during COVID. Mm. And then I said, there's one more to do, mindfulness book for mommy and me age, where yeah. there's activities before school, going to school, and after school. May I show you one? Yes, yes please. Yes. Oh, like, what's in those yes. pages? Right, you can well, never be too young I'm gonna, to, to start being mindful. I, I'm going to pick that. out uh, page okay. 22. Is my okay. friend Phil here supporting me today? This is his page right okay. here. Okay, Phil. Uh, yeah, turn it <laughs> right Phil. there. That's yeah, perfect. Phil talks to his friends. As you can see, it's in English and Spanish with oh. a hands-on activity at the bottom of each page. I want the kids to feel comfortable learning things that they're going to be doing every day mm -hmm. because that's going to improve their confidence. Yeah. And I wanted to take it one step further here at the end of the book. This book, because it's in two languages, yeah. I teach you how to write in English and Spanish. Oh, I cool. conjugate right. um, each verb, each noun. I use every word, I, he, right. she, we, they. And I have charts in the back of the book here with oh, each beautiful. verb and each that yeah. I use. I hug, we hug, they hug, yeah. and then also in Spanish. And that's for each word in the book. Yeah. So even, I hope, mommy and dad can also learn a little second right. language now. Still here in Tampa, I find in the schools a lot of bilingual students sure. and I yeah. feel a disadvantage because I can't make an impact and help as much as I could mm -hmm. if I did speak two languages. So I'm mm. a work in progress yeah. always. I've been yeah. taking Spanish lessons from a tutor in Colombia wow. over the last two years once a week. Oh, cool. So I'm building so these great. skill sets to yeah. make a bigger impact in my fields and mm -hmm. set a better example. Yeah, Beautiful. well that chart is very helpful. I might bring yeah. that home to my kids who are in Spanish right yes, now. Indeed. Yeah. Yes, indeed. Uh, can you talk about your first book? Did you bring that with you today? Yeah. One was the first, first book is Left for Dead. That's a story mm. really about who I am and what I went through. I yeah. started as a baby, introduced the world to who I am. Yeah. And then there is a journal my mom kept as a traumatic brain injury survivor. Yeah. The ridiculous things I said, did, ate, you name it. So that's in the book when it gets to that point in my life to help everyone out there who is in a mm. big time adversity situation and yeah. can't find a way through. Mm. Or you have a family member in the hospital. Mm. My mom, she stayed with me for almost a month at TGH. Wow. I have to plug to have a general hospital. Yeah. So grateful for the work they did on me. And it's a scary time. So yes. for the time that I was alone, my mom was alone, 
I hope to make other parents yeah. feel not alone during a really hard time. Wow, wow. that's beautiful. It you is, have yeah. really just uh, yeah. done so much with a horrible situation. So right. thanks for coming, yeah. sharing your story. Thank Incredibly you so much impressive. For having me. Yes. So if you'd like to learn more about these books, you can head to. just uh, yeah. done so much with a horrible situation so right. thanks for coming yeah. sharing your story Thank incredibly you so much impressive for having me. yes so if you'd like